Welcome back to Google Guru. This video is brought to you by Spanning. Today we're going to show you how to uh, take control of someone else's screen uh, using a Google Hangout on Air. Um, some reasons that you might want to do this is, let's say, you're doing a group presentation but you're all in different locations and you want to be able to switch back and forth um, between presenters without having to switch back and forth between computers. Uh, this is a really good way to do that. So, uh, I have my associate Lily Fu here. Hi, Lily. Hello, Andrea. <laughs> and I'm going to take control of Lily's computer, and I promise not to do anything terrible to it. <laughs> okay, so in order to do this, I'm going to click on the View More Apps button here on the uh, left side navigation, and I'll see a button that says Add Apps. The first one that comes up is Remote Desktop. Um, and that's the one that you would use to access somebody else's computer. So I'll go ahead and add that to the call. Okay, we've got it. And now I'm going to help Lily. And Lily <laughs> should get a notice. I did get a notice. I clicked, I clicked OK. Okay. Okay, it's connecting on my end. Okay, and now I can see Lily's computer. And you can see this is me moving my mouse around and accessing things. I know you have good taste in music, so let's pull up your iTunes. Oh, I don't have that much in there. I actually have a lot in uh, Spotify. And now I can play a song on your computer. <laughs> and it's that simple. Uh, okay. Thanks, everybody, for joining and watching today. Thanks, Lily, for letting me play a song on your computer. And I uh, hope everybody has a good day. Bye. Bye-bye.